Tehillim or Psalms. 65. To you, stillness, praise, and Zion, O Elohim. And to you, a vow is paid. To you who hears all prayer, all flesh comes. Crooked matters were mightier than I. As for transgressions, you do cover them. Blessed is the one you choose and bring near to dwell in your courts. We are satisfied with the goodness of your house, your set-apart hakal. By awesome deeds and righteousness, you answer us. O oh, Elohim of our deliverance, the trust of all the ends of the earth and the distant seas, who established the mountains by his strength, being girded with might, who stills the roaring of the seas, the roaring of the waves, and the uproar of the peoples. And they who dwell in the farthest parts are afraid of your signs. You make the outgoings of the morning and evening rejoice. You have visited the earth and watered it. You greatly enrich it. The river of Elohim is filled with water. You provide their grain, for so you have prepared it. Its ridges have been filled, its furrows have been deepened. You make it soft with showers. You bless its growth. You have crowned the year with your goodness, and your paths drip with fatness, and the pastures of the wilderness drip, and the hills are girded with rejoicing, and the meadows are dressed in flocks, and the valleys are covered with grain, they shout for joy and sing. Psalm 66. Shout with joy to Elohim all the earth, sing out the splendor of his name and make his praise esteemed. Say to Elohim, how awesome are your works. Through the greatness of your power, your enemies pretend obedience to you. All the earth bow to you. They sing praises to you. They praise your name, Selah. Come and see the works of Elohim. Awesome acts towards the sons of men. He's turned the sea into dry land, and they went through the river on foot. There we rejoiced in him, who rules by his power forever, his eyes keeping watch on the nations. Let the rebellious not exalt themselves, Selah. Bless our Elohim, you peoples, and sound his praise abroad, who keeps us in life and does not allow our feet to be moved. For you, O Elohim, have proved us. You have refined us as silver is refined. You brought us into the net. You laid afflictions on our loins. You have let men right at our head. We went through fire and through water, but you brought us out to plenty. I enter your house with ascending offerings. I complete my vows to you, that which my lips have uttered and my mouth spoke in my distress. Ascending offerings of fatlings I offer to you with the incense of rams. I offer bulls with goats, Selah. Come, hear, all you who fear Elohim, and I relate what he's done for my being. I called to him with my mouth, and praise was in my tongue. If I have seen wickedness in my heart, Yehovah would not hear. Truly, Elohim has heard me. He has given heed to the voice of my prayer. Blessed be Elohim, who has not turned away my prayer, nor his loving commitment from me. Psalm 67. Elohim does favor us and bless us, cause his face to shine upon us, Selah. For your way to be known on earth, your deliverance, among all nations. Let the peoples praise you, O Elohim. Let all the peoples praise you. Let the nations be glad and sing for joy, for you judge the peoples uprightly and lead the nations on earth. Selah.
Let the peoples praise you, O Elohim. Let all the peoples praise you. The earth shall give her increase. Elohim, our own Elohim, blesses us. Elohim blesses us. And all the ends of the earth fear him. Psalm 69. Save me, O Elohim, for waters have come up to my neck. I've sunk in deep mud and there's no place to stand. I've come into deep waters and the floods overflow me. I am worn out from my crying. My throat is dry. My eyes grow dim as I wait for my Elohim. Those who hate me without a cause are more than the hairs of my head. They are mighty who would destroy me, my lying enemies. What I did not steal, I restored. O oh, Elohim, you yourself know my foolishness, and my guilt has not been hidden from you. Let not those who wait for you, O oh, Master Yehovah of hosts, be ashamed because of me. Let not those who seek you be humbled because of me. O Elohim of Israel, because I've borne reproach for your sake, shame has covered my face. I have become a stranger to my brothers and a foreigner to my mother's children. Because ardor for your house has eaten me up and the reproaches of those who reproach you have fallen on me. And I wept in my being with fasting, and it became my reproach. And when I put on sackcloth, I became a proverb to them. They who sit in the gate talk about me, and I'm the song of drunkards. But as for me, my prayer is to you, O Yehovah, at an acceptable time, O Elohim. In the greatness of your loving commitment, answer me in the truth of your deliverance. Rescue me out of the mire, and let me not sink. Let me be rescued from those who hate me and out of the deep waters. Let not a flood of waters overflow me, nor let the deep swallow me up, nor let the pit shut its mouth on me. Answer me, O Yehovah, for your loving commitment is good. According to the greatness of your compassion, turn to me and do not hide your face from your servant, for I am in distress. Answer me speedily, draw near to my being, redeem it. Ransom me because of my enemies. You yourself know my reproach and my shame and my confusion. My adversaries are all before you. Reproach has broken my heart and I am sick. I looked for sympathy, but there was none. And for comforters, but I found none. And they gave me gall for my food. And for my thirst, they gave me vinegar to drink. Let their table before them become a snare and a trap to those at ease. Let their eyes be darkened so as not to see and make their loins shake continually. Pour out your wrath upon them and let your burning displeasure overtake them. Let their encampments be deserted. Let no one dwell in their tents. For they persecute him whom you have stricken, and talk about the pain of those you have wounded. Add crookedness to their crookedness, and let them not enter into your righteousness. Let them be blotted out of the book of the living, and not be written with the righteous. But I am poor and in pain. Let your deliverance, O Elohim, set me up on high. I praise the name of Elohim with a song, and I make him great with thanksgiving. And this pleases Yehovah more than an ox, a bull with horns and hooves. The humble shall see. They rejoice. You who seek Elohim and your hearts live. For Yehovah hears the poor and he shall not despise his captives. Let the heavens and earth praise him, the seas and all that moves in them. For Elohim shall save Zion and build the cities of Yehuda, and they shall dwell there and possess it, and the seed of his servants inherit it. And those who love 
his name dwell in it. And Psalm 70. Elohim, deliver me. Hasten to my help, O Yehovah. Let those who seek my life be ashamed and abashed. Let those who are desiring my evil be turned back and humiliated. Let those who say, aha, aha, be turned back because of their shame. Let all those who seek you rejoice and be glad in you. And let those who love your deliverance always say, Let Elohim be made great. But I am poor and needy. Hasten to me, O Elohim. You are my help and my deliverer. O Yehovah, do not delay. 